Hello wonderful viewers, welcome to my channel. In today's class, we shall be looking at this question. The question says, simplify root 1 whole number 9 over 16 plus into bracket 32 all over 162 plus bracket raised to power 1 over 2 divided by into bracket 27 all over 64 plus bracket raised to the power of minus 1 all over 3. Now, how do we go about this? The first thing is that we are going to give this a proper presentation. What do I mean by that? I'm going to make sure everything I am in for. As you can see, this one is in indices form. This one is also in indices form. So I'm going to change this back to indices form also. So the first thing is to change this mixed fraction to improper fraction. So that's going to be 16 multiplied by 1, 16 plus 9. That's going to give us 25 all over 16. Now let's put it into brackets. Now this square root here is going to change to the power of 1 all over 2. Don't forget when we have square root of 4, it's the same thing as saying 4 raised to the power of 1 over 2. So if you have to change root 4 to index form, we are going to have 4 raised to the power of 1 all over 2. So I will change this one to index form. So we are going to have plus 32 all over 162 raised to the power of 1 over 2 divided by 27 all over 64 raised to the power of minus 1 all over 3. Now the next thing to do the next thing to do is to check their powers. You notice that this power is positive, this is positive, this is negative. So in that case, let's change this back to positive also. How do we do that? Don't forget in indices, when we have s all over y into brackets raised to power negative e. Now, to change the power to positive, the fraction in the brackets will turn to reciprocal. So in that case, this will change to y all over x. And the power will now change to positive. So that is law of indices. The same thing will be applicable here. So we are going to have 25 all over 16 raised to the power of 1 all over 2 plus 32 all over 162 raised to the power of 1 all over 2 divided by 64 all over 27 raised to the power of 1 all over 3. So the negative sign has changed to positive. But the implication is that this 27 over 64 will change to reciprocal and that will be what 64 all over 27. now the next thing to do let's check the fractions if we can divide any one of them so you notice that we can divide this two can go here 16 and we have a two here 81 so this one let's bring it up 25 all over c all over 16 this to the power of 1 over 2 divided by 67 all over 64 rather all over 27 this to the power of 1 over 3 now to make it easier i can change them to index form so 25 we change to 5 square all over 4 square into brackets, then raised to power of 1 over 2 plus system will change to 4 square all over 9 square raised to power 1 over 2 divided by 64 will change to 4 raised to power 3 all over 3 raised to power 3 into brackets, then raised to power 1 over 3. Now the next thing, don't forget this power of 1 over 2 and the power of 1 over 2 here and the power of 1 over 3 here are applicable to both the numerator and the denominator in the bracket. So in that case, if I say 2 multiplied by 1 over 2, that is 1. 2 multiplied by 1 over 2 again, that is 1. So I'm going to have 5 1 over 4 plus... 2 multiplied by 1 over 2, 2 multiplied by 1 over 2, that is 1. So I'm going to have 4 all over 9. 
divided by 3 multiplied by 1 over 3, 3 multiplied by 1 over 3. So that's going to give me 1 also. So I'm going to have 4 all over 3. Now, the next thing is to apply board mass. So in board mass, division comes first. So in that case, we deal with the division. So we are going to have 5 all over 4 plus 4 all over 9. Now, our basic rule of mass, the division sign, we train to multiplication. And this, we flip over. So we are going to have 3 all over 4. In that case, 4 cancel 4, 3 year 1, 3 year 3. So we are going to be left with 5 all over 4 plus 1 all over 3. Now, let's find the SCM of this. The SCM of 4 and 3 is 12. So we can say 4 in 12, 3, 3 multiplied by 5, we have 15. Plus 3 in 12, 4, 4 multiplied by this, by 1, we have 4. And that will give us 19 all over 12. 19 divided by 12 will give us 1 whole number, 7 all over 12. Thanks for watching guys. Kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel at Mass Made Easy with Tony Fade. And also follow and like me on Facebook at Mass Made Easy with Tony Fade. Thanks for watching. See you again in my next video.